Rapids on the orange team. We got Roxana. It's going to be an interesting match. Both teams look pretty equally skilled. Roxana is currently 1-0, fighting to be one of the few 2-0 teams to get a favorable starting position in the bracket. Coon Rapids is looking to go 1-1 one and, one and qualify. If they lose this next game, they will not make the next round. This is a high-stakes matchup for our friends. Of course. And they are starting well, off good there. Looks like Orange Team actually had a little bit of a miss up though with the launch though. Came out pretty slow. Good pass there. Good clear up field. Ooh, but it hits the barrier. Yeah, geometry is not going to be in their favor there. Get intercepted by Zephyr. Could have a little bit of a clear there, but Talon's going to be right on him. Zephyr goes ahead and pushes it up field. Sneaks around Taco Man. He may not get there in time. He's a little grab this though. It could be a little clear that gets intercepted though by Blue. They're going to do a good throw downfield. Hits perfectly the bottom uh, right uh, tube. Tough bounce towards their territory, but a good clear once again into the orange. Could be low down the field. Talented throws it hard. It's going to actually bounce off the. Oh. It almost goes back in. We've already seen one of those. Yeah, so Zephyr's going to have the joke now. Intercept. Ooh, gets intercepted by Talented. It's a battle in the middle. Who will take it? That is true, but then again. Blue taps it, but it's still a standoff in the middle. Taco Man, with a mad dash, he does not get the throw off like he wanted to. Looks like Zephyr's gonna have the disc. They get stolen by Talented! Just like that, they're able to get the first two points. It's gonna be Blue Team with the just advantage here. Looks like the votes are gonna be coming out of top row. It's gonna be Northern with the disc. He's gonna try to pass it to Zephyr, but actually gets thrown right to the enemy. Yeah. And a hard clear up field. Dangerous yeah. territory. It's actually gonna go in a weird position. Zephyr still is able to grab it though. He does get the gonna go for a good clear. Gets it off the one roll. Will he get the second? Oh, perfectly. Pass it to him. And That's gonna be three. a three pointer. Coon Rapids looking to make a statement. Yeah, that was a good move right there. First, that was a perfect uh, clear, and then it perfectly bounced right back to him. It's going to be Orange Team with the disc now. That's how we're looking so far. Pretty even square off. We're only a couple minutes in. Mm hmm. Seven minutes 20 left on the clock. To be talented with the disc. Looks like both the blue team overextended there, but they might be able to get back in time. Yes. A weird throw straight up sends it back into orange territory. Not what he was trying yeah. to do. Yeah. Oh. Talented it looks like trouble with those reverse throws. Yeah. Northern is unable to grab it though. He's gonna be able to get it back. Good pass. Orange team could have it. It could be a goal. Interesting throw though. It's gonna be a good pass. Gets blocked. Unself oh, no. pulls it. Zephyr sadly pulls it in, self goals himself on accident. A good snag, but pulled himself back in. Sadly, that's gonna lose them the lead. Blue team gonna have the disc advantage now. We've been mostly without self goals this whole tournament, but we've seen two in the last two games. Yeah, it looks like it's gonna be Zephyr moving in. Zephyr taking the low route. Take a it's a wide throw over there. Hard throw. Gets hit by the pillar, surprisingly. He's going to be able to clear it. Townsend isn't able to grab onto it, though. But I think that might be okay for him. They miss again. It's going to be cleared, however. Zephyr looks like, oh, he's not actually able to grab first. Taco has a bit of an opening there, but accidentally tosses it early. Good rebound for him, though. Another two points by Taco, man. Okay. Alright, blue 
with their classic one and boost strategy. Ooh, he's actually gonna be able to stop. Oh, gets intercepted. Taco is gonna have a good. Oh, he throws it. Ooh, goes over the top. But oh, he does it again. Over each side. Looks like they're not gonna be able to get to it fast enough though. It's gonna be taken back by Orange Team. Thrown. Orange Team puts it up high. Blue Team. Zephyr has it. Taking it around the right. They may, may carry it. They uh, holds onto it too long. Gives Orange yeah. Team another opportunity. Looks like it's gonna be uh, not talented and not Taco to grab it e e uh, either. Taco throwing it up Could high. Be a... He's gonna kind of give it away there. Zephyr's gonna get it though. He's gonna go for. Decent clear there, but I think the geometry might not work to the favor, but it works pretty decently. Still gets it across the half court line. That's about as much yep. as you can ask for. Ooh, Ooh. geometry bounce. It comes right back to him. Yeah. You take it in. It goal is open. Zephyr gets stuck on the thing. He's, he bounced it with his head. What a save. He saved it with his head. Oh, Taco's going to get the disc though. He's going to throw it back and miss, sadly. Townsend's going to have it. It's going to be an open goal, though. And I'm will they get him with the stun? Will they save it? They will not. Uh, 8 to 3. 8 to 3. This is not looking that good for Roxanne. I mean, not Roxanne, Coon Rapids. Yeah. Coon Rapids cannot afford to, to let this one go either. This is a, a do or die game for them. Yeah. Blue team again has got the Joseph advantage here. That first gonna be flying in. Knocked one guy. Talented though is gonna still up. He has to throw it early. Oh. Fortunate bounce almost. Yeah, well, almost. Have position here though. Ooh. Can they get the quick inside shot? A sweet yeah. Meter per second. Yeah, it's gonna be two points. When they're able to get a hold of the disc and get up field, they're pretty lethal. They're just having trouble recovering it. Yeah. Like I said, they're going on offense. Defense, not that much though. Pounding the rim here. Just trying some spunk in it, you know. Mm hmm Here it goes. Let's see what he does off the bat. Throws it right through the blue team. Ooh, it's actually able to send it back. This could if it's team making get to it. Oh, oh the geometry bounce. though. Tons is actually gonna be able to grab it first. Oh actually uh Tons is gonna be able to steal it there. The geometry working in his favor. It's a hard clear Not hits the thing time. though. He's gonna get it back Almost again. Blue just cannot get a handle on the disc when it becomes a 50-50 play. Yeah. They get deep in the blue team side. It's a dangerous position for the blue team if Orange gets this disc. Yeah. Looks like they might. Zephyr's moving. Ooh, they don't get the backboard shot. Just barely misses. Has them showing off uh, cost them that point. Clear to mid here. Will they pick it up? Oh, it goes a little too far. Gonna have to throw it backwards. Geometry though, working in their favor. Gonna get it pretty close to it. Ooh, stuns oh, him, stunned. and just like that. Puts it in with two minutes left. This is looking pretty dicey for Coon Rapids. Down yeah. by five. Get to watch an orange team see what kind of launch they're going for here. Looks like they're uh, doing the classic uh, right on top of each other's back strategy. Ooh, Blue's thing though is if one member gets service. stunned. Ooh, geometry though is not gonna work that well. Can't get it deep in there. Again, orange just comes be up talented, able minutes. to grab it. It's gonna be a one on one uh, near the disc. Talented is able to get there deep. A good dodge by Zephyr. Looks like he's going to go for a decent clear there. Get to, get to the halfway point. He's going to be talented grabbing it again. Ooh. Northern uh, sadly misses it barely. It's going to be a show how well he can do. Looks like, Blue not looks like he must have punched that. something. I think Taco might have accidentally punched something. Oh, might have hit something in his play space. <laughs> yeah. I think it might have been a family member or something. All I heard was him screaming, Leo. Nice. Get it, get it, get it, get it. Animal or a family member, the classic. Oh, I got it away from him. Hits the bear. Zephyr is playing pretty conservative in goal right now. It might cost him. It does. It does. 
He played conservative right until he got close, and then he just got out of the goal. Yeah, I'm wondering if Blue just needs to be a little more aggressive on going to the disc. They're not fighting for those 50-50s, and it's costing them. When they have the, yeah. the field advantage, they're certainly capitalizing, getting those big threes. Yeah. Orange hanging very far back. They might have got a bad launch. Oh. They know they have the lead. Oh, yeah, with four seconds. Two seconds left. And that'll, that'll be go. first okay. round. 12 to 5 for round one. That's going to be uh, Roxana winning the first round. Take a quick stat break here. Zephyrwolf with all five points and all seven saves. Northern helped him out with 11 stuns, but just not able to have enough possession of the disc. Let's see what that looks like. Yeah, 60-40 possession, 11 to four shots. They're just not getting up field in the way that they can now take good shots. But when they do, they're capitalizing. I mean, they were they were two for four. That's not a bad shot percentage. Why isn't your brother heading to his room? Yeah. I do believe uh, we have confirmation that it was actually uh, Taco's brother that got in the. Okay. <laughs> but the thing Taco is, letting his brother know passing. who's boss. Yeah, you are. Yeah. Well, by that I mean I'm not very. That good was an 11 that. to 5, yes. did we say? No, that's fine. Uh, I believe so. I usually throw we'll it. We'll confirm here. that. Mm -hmm. I usually throw it. Throw put it that down it as like 11 that. to 5. Yeah, that's what I do. Is I flick it. No, don't do this. Don't throw it like a normal frisbee. That's not the okay. good way. Uh, oh no, 10 to 5. 10, 10 to 5. There we go, that sounds about right. So like that. No, not, not this, this. 7 save is ridiculous. He was putting in work. Interesting strategy, they're gonna have Taco going in uh, Catapult 1 and Talented going Catapult number 2. Oh, but it looks like they're actually gonna switch to the other sides. So I don't know if there's any democracy players watching, but it looks like right now they are on the hot seat. If Coon Rapids wins this match, they may well knock Democracy off. But if they win, yeah. then Coon Rapids could be our <laughs> final person to advance. Ooh, Ooh dinks it off the side immediately. It's a scary Ooh, start. In good a save there. Round. Yeah. Could be Orange Team holding it up there. Does an interesting throw. Ooh, isn't able to get to it though. Oh, it looks like we might have lost Northern here. Yeah, Northern just, just sitting there. It looks like his teammate went AFK. His teammate went well, AFK. This may wait, be wait, wait, no, 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 a reset. Oh, yep, yeah, he has been disconnected. No. All right, we'll see if we can figure out what happened here. Yeah. Hopefully it's just internet connection and not a quest battery thing. Yeah, hopefully not. If it's a quest battery, that may be a, a slightly longer delay. <laughs> And Lord knows, Coon Rapids has had enough of their share of delays in this one. But we'll hang around for a bit. Yeah, we're going to be waiting for this one. Just to get any confirmation, they're not going to be... So we're most likely going to have to restart the round. It does seem that way. They're already in, so the pausing yeah, does not seem... Like Pause has been requested, actually. Okay. The request so... not approved. I will join blue team and quickly accept that. Yep. Appreciate it. Wait, that's unpausing. Wait, what? Do I have to switch to orange then to do the pause? Yeah, both of these just say unpause. Unpause, interesting. Clock is still Here. running, so there's some shenanigans across the board. Maybe if I hit unpause? We'll sort out what's going on here with our... Pause requested. Patterns. Weird. Weird indeed. A little bit of technical difficulties on top of the uh, shenanigans we're having with hardware. Yeah. Whoa! No, that's Electro. A that's Electro. In the middle. Dude, that's Electro. Waiting for okay, uh, his quest some more action. Now. We're going to have a party join that's hopefully going to be... Yeah, we'll probably have first to restart teammate. this one since so much time has yeah. passed. Yeah. Okay, he's back. Should we just restart the match since Penis, it's 0-0? 
TP. I'm back. Alrighty, uh, we are going to restart this round. Okay. So yeah. Full restart. Point to still get a, uh, point to still get a stick for the first round, but for the second round, we're going to be restarting. I yep. think we're going to end up restarting the round. Not that there's many points on the board to worry about I to begin gonna, with. I, Fortunately, I the issue was. Yeah, so just hit a restart. Yep, we're restarting. We're restarting the. We're, we're restarting it. Hey. Hang on. That's Oz's request. For us to restart it, I gotta head back to the. Yeah, are you waiting for both teams to accept the restart request? Looks like Orange is headed back to base to take the restart. Blue team has the disc. And there it goes. The rematch has began. Yep, we'll Show get right round. back into this. Shows round one of three, but we have one round done. First score was ten to five, orange to blue. Are you, are you good? Are you charging? Waiting for teams to now ready up once again. Okay, that second look. It is plugged in. It's right here. I know, but it doesn't mean it's charging. I'm I'm crouching. Okay, let me check. Yep, it's char it's charging. Yep, both teams are ready. We'll be getting into it. I just, I just have to keep my head slouched over. That's all. Still do not know the reason why uh, Zephyr's teammate got disconnected there. Unfortunately, it was before any points had been scored. No shenanigans on that front. Yes. A bit of craziness on the launch there. Looks like Northern was not ready to go. Just kind of sitting around. Northern comes in late and hot. Townsville's gonna have the disc there. Goes for a little 360 throw. Doesn't do well though on it. And can Zephyr's gonna be sitting in the goal, just kind of waiting for something to happen. I'm not sure if that's the play in the 2v2. Yeah. Because they can get away from just uh, his other teammate. They can have just one of his teammates get it. All right, just like that. Oh, Ooh, actually miss it there. Northern may be able to go get it. But as long as Zephyr's in goal, Northern's basically playing a 2v1 for the free discs. That's yeah, who dinks it again? Yeah, 2v1s. Especially yeah. people talented, uh, especially people like Talented and Taco. See, right here. See what they do. This is interesting. Oh. Sneaks it in the top. Yeah. 2-0. Once again for the orange team. Looking to knock off Coon Rapids out of the entire tournament. Yeah. You can have four uh, team lost here. I think they would still be uh, in the tournament. Yeah, they're, they're right on the hairy edge. I think it's up to Coon Rapids right now, basically, on who's going to make the finals. Yeah. Oh, an unfortunate bounce back, or they would have had a free goal there. Ooh, big throw downwards. Sadly, it gets ricocheted. Zephyr now taking the forward back. position. That's two on him. Just to, to clear it. That was a pass back. That was a pass Takes a big back. bounce and ricochets around behind the orange goal. Northern orange used to be able to get it fast. You talent, uh, Taka with the disc now. Tries passing a talented, but sadly, geometry doesn't allow it. Still, Zephyr doing a 2v1 isn't a good thing. Yep. Now these stuns going to be a huge breakaway here. Northern are playing uh, really defensively in the thing. He's in the cube in front of it instead of the goal ring itself. He does have a bit of restrictive movement there. Misses the pass there. But again, they're, they're playing super conservative inside that sphere. If they're going to get any points, they're going to have to try a slightly different strategy, I'm feeling. Yes. Zephyr is able to pass it upwards. Northern out here. Take his view. He's just taking a really conservative eye on it. He's kind of waiting yeah. for it. Sneaks behind the goal. Look doesn't go in. Yeah. Zephyr sounds like he's trying to guide him, but Northern just seems a little bit lost, maybe. Yeah. And once again, sneaks it in the top of the goal. He's not moving around much, either. It's weird. He's sitting very sad by just holding the cube in front of it. It's going to be blue team with the just advantage here. 
I think that play, uh, play style might cost them the tournament. I'll get the yeah, we'll see. From the back seven minutes here, they they try to change it up at all. Yeah. They're sending two forward now with the joust advantage. A, a, what looked like a good clear got some terrain. It's gonna be a one v one up in the orange side. Talent is gonna have a clear lead on the disc. Zephyr's gonna take a hold at mid. Up top, middle. And just like that, it is gone. Far throw there. Big bounce. Northern's not even chasing it. So he's gonna get stuck. Another dicey situation here with orange shot on goal. No way. Hey, hey, hey. They keep get it dirt to Mr. Dinker right now. I think even if Northern isn't particularly confident getting out there, he just needs to kind of dive out for the disc now and again just to see if they can change it up, put them on their toes. Just a little bit under six minutes left. Zephyr's going to be able to uh, stun Talented, but it's going to be Taco Man able to grab the disc again. Rebounds it, misses. They tried to rebound it. Yeah, yeah. Hey, hey, hey. Toss it to me. Toss it to me. Yeah, Northern's just kind of hanging back there on that one. Who is ever able to get it? It's a good clear. But even then, Northern are just staying there, not moving. Yep, I'm not sure. I expect this if they have the lead, but they're just staying there. Zephyr is able to get the disc though. Isn't uh, really. Ooh, actually, he's able to dodge he down to there. Dodge his way out. Does he get? Oh, it's a little low. Oh, and isn't able to catch the rebound. Orange is going to get another re-push. Yeah, they're just, they're playing how one on one. a typical 3v3 with a goalie back. Uh, it's just, it's not working for him. Yeah, and look at that. Northern not even moving for that, just reaching upwards. Yeah, I'm not really sure what's happening with him there. Yeah. It's hard to see. Maybe battery issue and he's plugged in? Maybe. Maybe he's contained or maybe a hand's not working. I'm not sure. But they're yeah. sending him up ahead right now. It looks like his tracking's fine. Yeah. Good upfield. So, uh, oh, tries to pass it and gets taken right before he gets it out. Yeah, it's another to get that going. But I think their best play is just doing 2v2 out in the open. Yeah. I mean, they got to get six points ASAP. Good throw downfield. He is plugged in. Okay. That makes That's sense. why. Yeah, because he looked very staticky there. Like, when he moved around, he didn't seem like he had full motion. Yeah, that's unfortunate. So, I guess, yeah, in the previous, his battery had to have just died. Yeah. How did I not knock him out? What? Another scramble out in the open. I th I at least like to see if they're both out in the open now. They realize it's a little more urgency because they got to score twice. I got it. Yeah. And defend cleanly. No, I don't. Yeah, they'd have to tie it up by getting two three pointers here. But Zephyr's going to be able to throw again and make another two pointer. It's not looking good for Coon Rapids. Yeah. No, you aren't. It's me. To be honest. No, it's not. Because I haven't scored a single fucking goal this game. Neither have I, that makes us bullshit. No. Northern taking a slow approach. Zephyr gonna push it out. See if we can send Northern up here for a score. He's not tracking the disc though, he's probably not gonna get it. It's gonna go into the hands of the orange team, swooping in. Yeah, it's gonna be into the hands of Talented. Talented has the disc. They used to say back when I played Ultimate, he's gonna have to have his library card checked in. They're juking me. Yeah. He hasn't learned how to Imagine read the disc yet. Me twice already. Dude, dude, I'm juking Those bounces can be brutal. <laughs> or at least tried to. Gonna be coming from the bottom using some floor jukes there. Yep. They're just probably playing for time now. They don't yeah. have the 8-0 lead. Don't let him Even so, he still goes for another two-pointer. Yeah, Cheggy, this is an actual game. Zero to They're 2v2 in for their life right now. And it's not looking good. Yeah. Uh, I didn't even realize I had three. So just some context for anyone who wasn't here earlier. Um, the blue team had to request 
Oh, and they dropped the disc. They had requested they dropped two, the disc. Um, because one of their headsets didn't make it to their third yeah, teammate in time. Um, and their school was closed up, so fortunately their opponents have been kind enough to oh, let them play 2v2, the but so far they've been struggling to get anything going. They do Ooh, they get a clean three-pointer, though. They finally get the breakaway they've been looking for, so they're not going to get bageled, but... Still 10-3 with a minute and a half left. It's not looking favorable. Indeed. We're going to keep it on blue, see how they approach this. Northern's a little twitchy back here. He's just trying to shake out the bad vibes. Mm-hmm. Could be talented uh, with the disc going for it. He's right by. He's hoping for his teammate to make a play. Yeah. Talented still could have the disc, though. It's stunned in goal. They're not even going to shoot it. They're just you. hanging out, playing conservative, and that'll be 12-3. I think that seals the deal. Indeed. They got 52 seconds left on the clock now. Going to be around 45 when they launch. They would have to have some impressive scoring speed here. Yeah. And even then, I don't think Orange Team's going to give it to them. Unless they can make uh, Artemis speed uh, scores in four seconds each. I don't think they have it. Get it up to northern. No, it'll get stolen immediately. This gets is gonna be stolen the game. again. Oh man, and that's another two pointer. Just a brutal turn in this one after the first one looked like they might have, have a solid There's shot. There's a close out. one. The first one, the second one's just not looking good. 18 seconds. With 15 so seconds left, they can put some more points on the board, but even then, I think this may be try to get the, the score up even a tiny bit. bit. Again, Again Orange Team is going to be able to steal the disc, and that's just, ooh, and round over. isn't able to score it, though. So that'll be a 2-0 win. With, them With ta that. They're taking the big match, so let's see. That'll be 14-3. to We'll tally these scores up for you really quick no, here second. and give you a report on how we landed. Sure that being the final game of the, uh, Semi uh, finals, no, uh, not semi finals, uh, up pre uh, runs, right? So, if you stick around for just a moment here, I will have some live updates on what will tentatively be, until we confirm these, your final positions. That'll be Roxana joining the elite group of 2 and 0 teams, adding another 24 points to their score. Give me just a moment here to wheel and deal in my spreadsheet. I'm going to move some things around and show you the goods. Alright, so it looks like with that, I have our unofficial list of advancements. In first place, we appear to have Pasco, which should come as no surprise to the people who watch those games, with a solid 80 points over four rounds, a 20-point average. Behind them, Buena Park, the other 2-0 school. Give me just a moment here as I have shuffled some things that I should not have. It looks like after them, as I said, joining that elite crew of other 2 and 0 schools will be Roxana, jumping up to third place on the final day of the competition. Congratulations to them. Behind that is Manhattan. I might be a little biased. They are my team. They will take the fourth place spot with an average of 9 points per game. Then is Concord Carlisle at 5th place. Lubbock, Dufer, and Democracy. Unfortunately, that will leave Coon Rapids just short with the other 0-2 teams all being knocked out. That would be them, Lewiston, and DeVry. With an average of points that are actually higher than some of the other teams, they just weren't able to get the big W, to put them into the winner's bracket and advance on. <laughs> so with that, thank you for tuning in to all thank of you our for 
free limbs and all of the other technical issues, shenanigans, other fun stuff we've had. We appreciate you sticking around and we'll hope to see you in the next rounds. Congratulations again to those eight teams that have moved on. We'll see and have you a good day. Further this week. Have a good night.